るわけないでしょそんなもの<笑>先手<笑>キス貴様はかニュースかそれは I love his understanding, right? He basically calls them like, we need a chef woman. Get in the kitchen! <laughs> he calls them like, he needs to, he knew he wants to revive his uh, ultimate front chef from, from Paris, right? And she's like, why, why are you telling me get in the kitchen? Get in the kitchen, woman! <laughs> Shut up and get into the kitchen, lady. Yeah, then of course they actually do revive the ultimate chef lady. <laughs> yeah, which is very France, I guess, correctly. But I love the first scene here. It's like, calls the, calls the other woman like, we need a woman in the kitchen. I need a specific lady, go into the kitchen lady. She's like, what, what, what are you talking about? Go into the kitchen. It's like, oh, I meant to revise the kitchen lady. <laughs> it's like, yeah, misunderstanding, man. I love it. Ooh, fine, more of the story. I love anime. I think one of the best anime ever. I just cry, man. Because I am a little support of thinking, but still, though. I actually did a video about IQ and so on, so let's go for that. And I, of course, showed you my Senku abilities. Got my, you know, brain trusted Poshita. Last Forge season, episode 2 and 3, right? Or episode 38, right? So, yeah, so 3, 2, 1. And go. So man, the reward shooting me, I love that. It's really fun, man. Let's have some Minecraft, was great. Yeah, yeah, Quacko is the, come on. Yeah, and he, he's a chef, man. He's a little, Unfree's a chef, man. Quacko loves though. She's just like, yeah, gorilla girl. She's a lioness. She can eat that. I mean, it's, I need someone better cooking. Yeah, we need to revive someone with uh, chef skills. Thank you. It's like, yeah, whatever, man. Okay. <laughs> So we saw this episode, of course, they invented agricultural revolution. That's the first thing you start usually with, but yeah. Senki goes backward. But yeah, he needs better food, man. He's like, I need to be a sailor, man. And he, he thinking about scurvy, that's it. He's like, scurvy. We're gonna get scurvy, man. We need to have better cooking. I see, I see. <laughs> He's anti-scurvy. This makes my sense. This makes sense, man. He's anti-scurvy. Definitely. Opening? Yeah. This is actually, uh, I've seen this might be my favorite opening. Might make an opening tea list later after seeing all the openings, but this might be my favorite opening because I really love the song. I mean, that image too, but man, I listen to it a lot. This is from here. But this actually, yeah, I don't know, like Demon Slayer to create, right? Some more good openings too, but I think this is. Could be my favorite. It's probably the opening I have listened to the most. It's heard it right, like I have it on loop. I listen to a lot of openings like when I work and so on, or you know, play games or whatever. This might be the one I listen to the most so far. So this is probably my number one open this season. This part here. Man, yeah, I think it's the best opening, probably. I haven't seen all opens yet, right? Ushino Koi, they had the song, but they had the opening so on. So I'm waiting a little bit to, you know, put my life. Also, we have today we have. Uh, what's Column again? Uh, this guy's the Osama Ranking, right? Osama Ranking is back, it's a spin off. And that, those opens are really good in the first season of that. So, yeah. But this is probably my winner. Um, do, 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 do. Then, uh, if it's the most shown open to, yeah. But Demon Slayer is great too, though. Man with the Mission is also. I love Man with the Mission, so. Demon Slayer is definitely up there too. And I don't just say that because, oh, it's hype, you know, Demon Slayer say that because I should really like Man with the Mission, right? I'm not just like pretending to, you know, like <laughs> Man with the Mission. Like half people are. I mean, generally, some people are pretending to like, you know, the new opening of Demon Slayer because it's like famous, right? Hyped anime. You know, I love Man with the Mission, so. I feel like either one of these two. But yeah, so he calls his hot wife food. He's like, hey, bring me some chef over here. <laughs> he's like, woman, get in the there. kitchen, woman. He seriously is like, calls the, the pretty lady that was like, get into the kitchen. You know, I need some of it food. Yeah, he sees the calling her like, woman, get into the kitchen. Yeah. Yeah, you're hiding something, lady. See, he's calling her like, show me your pantsu. Think they're really misunderstanding you. <laughs> but he literally calls her and is like, woman, I know you're hiding something and get in the kitchen. It's like, yeah, I think this got really misunderstood her. They're like, wait, what, what? Exactly. She got an amazing figure. <laughs> uh, yeah, answer this thing to him.
Here we go. <laughs> the, uh, misunderstanding is massive here. Yeah. Get wet, lady. <laughs> what is this scene? God, I had to start coming, man. That was so weird, man. And of course, Senku is like, yes, the flow of science. <laughs> Senku is all about the math, man. He's like, the science. <laughs> like, no, I don't think they, I don't think you would say thing, Senku. Here we go. Yeah. She's hiding it. Finding up what she was hiding. Yeah. Yeah. Who was the chef, man? <laughs> but I love it. It's like the cost of the most arguably most attractive wife in the anime, right? The classic, like, wife is like, get in the kitchen. Yeah, and I was like, find me some chefs. Man, ever so ripped, ever so, ever so muscular, ever so hot, man. Come on. Everyone is freaking... Uh... Ah, it's the woman in the opening, right? Yeah, yeah, it's a new lady in the opening. Not a blonde lady in the opening. It's definitely her. I mean, I mean, I'm all up, but yeah, it's obviously her in the opening. This is a woman that looks like a, yeah, a French lady in the opening. As I said in my opening reaction review, right? Exactly. This is a woman in the opening that's like... Looks like she's from uh, Paris or whatever, right? As I, as I call it out in my, yeah, in my notation. This is obviously her then. She's gonna be like a French chef, right? She's gonna be the master. She's gonna be like Sogu to Soma stylist. She's like Erina. <laughs> I got another figure over there, yeah. She's the Erina character. Coming in with her uh, France. Uh... Here we go. It's clearly her. She's uh, from Paris or whatever. Oh, she's gonna be a wife doing it. Yeah, they're gonna dress her up quickly. The ladies already. See, she's like fra She's like Napoleon enters. Yeah, exactly. She's the French lady. <laughs> yeah, she's just like I'm ready to cook food <laughs> immediately. It's like I'm free to chef. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. They revive the super chef. Here we go. Yeah, you geeky, cook food! <laughs> I like how he's like, tired. he's like, yeah, geeky, good! Food! Meshi! Oh, that's nice, she's like, yeah, she, let's move! <laughs> she's very professional, let's move, guys! She immediately is like, revived, is like, okay, let's go! <laughs> what? Yeah, she's a very hard color. I like a color. She got the three color. Yeah, she got the France, you know, three color, right? She got the, uh, yeah, the typical. Yeah, she's very France. She's very, very France. <laughs> is she France? Oh, who knows? But yeah, I mean, I said it right in my opening reaction. I was like, oh, yeah, the woman is clearly from Paris or something. Yeah, I was like, this a woman. Like, Napoleon survived, yeah. Okay. The greatest butler world in the world. And this is, yes. Ryo Shan, this is. <laughs> She's super serious. She just walks in here. Hey, boys! She's like, yeah, okay. Yeah, she's walking all night, I guess. He's hardcore, man. Hardcore. This is the greatest person from France ever! My chef! <laughs> yeah, I need, I, need, I need a better person on my boat, man. I love it though that this is, the whole thing is like, yeah. We got, we got a lady now so we can cook food her. It's disgusting. Yeah, it's disgusting, the food of course. Make it better. Make it better, lady. Quaku likes the shit. Oh, it was so good. It's like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Quaku is like, this is the best food I ever ate. It's like, there's something wrong with you, cave lady. Yeah, it's the greatest chef ever. They're going swarm on us straight up, man. Yeah, <laughs> they go a hardcore swarm, man. It's like easy. Ten months. Pfft. Easy. Yeah. 
Yeah, so you're gonna have this. And I make food and so on, right? <laughs> and Kowaku's gonna go out and hunt some course. Of course, Kowaku is there to hunt, yeah, and get milk and so on. <laughs> Kowaku is there to get all the milk, man. It's good, Kowaku. Yeah, she's there to help out get the milk. Very good, very good. Yeah, Kowaku got her stuff, you know. She's like, yes, she's the milk lady. So you got that milk, man. Yeah, so they make making butter and so on, yeah. But, but like, she's like, yeah, I need butter, I need this thing. She's like, I'll teach you how to make food properly. Yeah, they're like, yes, this woman is a genius chef. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I need berries, I need my milk. I guess they got monsters, I guess, when they're collecting all the food somewhere right there. Now she's baking and... <laughs> she got everyone to bake. Yeah, she got every, all the guys to bake for her, yeah. Shut up and do my cooking. Yeah, they're like, okay. Um... There we go, there we go. Now they're baking and it's gonna make the food store, you know. It's gonna make the food last longer for the trip or something. That's the whole point, you know. He's all about the scurvy, you know. He's like, I've heard of scurvy, yeah. He's trying to save them from scurvy, clearly. Um, but it's nice, you know. He got his, you know, Seiko got his, um, uh, how's it, furnace, I guess, you know, that he can use his furnace, right, as, of course, a chef, uh, yeah, as a. Basically, right, yeah, basically. Um, yeah, it's so ultimate butler, uh, ultimate friend chef lady. Okay, she's like, yes, the sink guy. He's pretty good for our money, yeah. He's pretty good when it comes to our income, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna test the food here. The course, they're gonna cry now, these K people. This PINANDE KORE! Yeah! Of course, Kwaku to be like, WHAT?! <laughs> yeah. So they were like, oh, this is fr Yeah, because she was just like, oh yeah, this like stone tastes so good, yeah. Then the woman basically eating like rocks and like, this is great, so... She's clearly gonna have like a brain uh, damage from how good this is. Yeah. Slowing people, man. <laughs> the ultimate chef enters, yeah. <laughs> I like how she's so serious. <laughs> she's so ice cold and serious. Yes, ultimate food. Uh, but I like how she's so. She looks almost dead inside, you know. She's just like, that's right, my food. Yeah. She was like, okay. Now, of course. Uh, oh, that's like. He's crying now, of course. Yeah, it's so good. It's so good. It's so good! <laughs> oh my! <laughs> oh my! Yeah, these poor people, they finally get to taste real food, you know. They're like, why? You can't cook food like this? Yeah, they're all kind of shocked at how good food can be, right, of course. Yeah, she's teaching them the recipe now. Oh, you're gonna stay in the, you know, you're gonna put this thing here and cook it for, wait for three days and. Yeah, this will ferment, so yeah, teach them how to ferment and all the stuff like that, yeah. She's gonna teach them different skills, obviously, like fermentation, right, how to smoke meat, so on. And the reason you do this like this is because if you go on sailing, for example, if you, uh, you know, smoke your food, right, it lasts longer, like a smoked fish, or if you have, I mean, the reason we humans kind of invented, like, you know, salt curing and so on, right, is because a curd fish uh, lasts longer, right? So, it's all about, like, you know, in, in extending that, you know, food um, uh, viability, right, for, like, a long sailing and so on. And, of course, scurvy is because you lack uh, side vitamin, right? So, you have fruit and so on, right? like, oranges and citrus, you know, and lemonades, you know. Yeah. Like, <laughs> Haku in the back, eating bread, man. <laughs> yeah. This is really tasty! Yeah, like, she's all... Of course, now she's super happy, I can eat... Okay, what's the old man's plan? Okay. I don't know, he was like, I got a strategy, man. Uh, something like that. Oh, here we go, the car thing. Yeah, we got, what is this thing? The gorilla car? This is an opening, yeah, the big thing in the opening, man. That's like the weird, I guess they rebuilt the tank, I guess, from the last season. The, the, the war tank they had, right? I guess so. 
<laughs> hey, cause the old man, and he's all like, "Where's my with a hot lady?" <laughs> he's like, "Yeah." <laughs> he got the hot chick with him too. He got like a biker or something. Yeah, he's like, hey, "I got my wife food with me." Uh, he's, I love. She really adds something to it. Yeah, she really adds something to it. In the sunglasses behind him, like, "Yeah." <laughs> this scene is awesome. Oh, I love it. He turned into like a biker or something. Yeah. And now it's gonna build stuff, of course. Shaker's gonna motivate him. No, but I love it, man. He's into like a badass bike. Yeah, I got my big uh, wife and lady with me. <laughs> what? And now, of course, Shaker's like, you have to build stuff for me. Yeah. Glass and so on. Come on. Oh, it smells. Oh, yeah, ammonia. So it's gonna be like um, smelly, man. Yeah, it's like, NAM DE KURA! A mirror, I see myself! Yeah, I'm so ugly! Exactly, he invented mirror, basically. More or less, right? <laughs> yeah, Kagami? <laughs> I like Krom, he's also pretty! He's turning into a narcissist! Oh, I'm so attractive! He's like, oh yeah, he's like... Uh, Oh, she's still angry over it. Yeah, she's she's angry, man. She's a sassy wife after all. Yeah. Oh. What I want is a commercial tool. Yeah, you want like an actual mirror, man. Oh, but it's cute. But it's cute. They are like I like Chrome is turning into an narcissist. He just keeps staring at his own mirror in the background. Um. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, I will recreate civilization <laughs> to become God. <laughs> She's so happy now. Yeah, but come on. She's a pretty lady. She's just like, oh, we got it. We got to fix this thing. Oh, I don't want to live in this stone age. You know, I want to have like my perfect mirror and so on. Yeah. Which is nice now. Yeah, she's all sad now. I'm crying here. Oh, this is a great scene now. Yeah, she's all like crying here. Like, thank you, thank you. You have revived what's important to me. Beauty. <laughs> a little bit like that, yeah. You have saved the beauty of the world. You know, it's nice, man. She's all like, uh, you know, happy about it. It's a nice scene, yeah. She's all like, oh my god. You saved us, thank you. You saved us from the evil Stone Age. Um. <laughs> Yeah, finally got the camera back, you know. <laughs> yeah, but she means she wants to be, you know, photographed in the world and so on. She wants to be reported, right? Yeah, it's nice. And he's all about money, of course. Yeah, the ocean is all like, yeah, we can make food with this thing. <laughs> oh, that guy, man. This guy's lag is crazy. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, I did time it off now because it keeps lagging. It's taking the first photo here now. Yeah, I took the first photo. Thank you, it's gonna <laughs> be the first. <laughs> it's trying to get different, uh, yeah, different, like, yeah, if this is okay. <laughs> That's Yankee! That's what I want, Yankee, thank you. Ooh, Crossers, thank you. This is what I want, Crossers, thank you. This is what I want, man, Crossers, thank you. Yeah, you finally get to... Yeah, do a pose, thank you. She gonna be here, yeah. Peace and that's it. Peace. Oh, I'm probably gonna show it at the end of this episode. Yeah, but it's nice. He got the ca he invented the camera again. She's all happy, you know. Yeah, he invented the camera, man. <laughs> yeah, but I like he's like finally taking photos again. Yeah, we can take photos. And the out another recognition, you know. Yeah, they're out taking photos, of course, of the, of the plane and so on, yeah, of the city. Yeah, something like that. There's like, yeah, removing the quicksilver poison, I guess. Yeah, like mer quicksilver, mercury, poisoning, SPD. Oh yeah, now they're getting the first photo, I guess. <laughs> now they're getting the first photo here, they're like... 
Yeah, he's a uh, super Einstein here with them, so yeah. Yeah, of course he's doing the Einstein photo, right? To get the Einstein photo. I see. <laughs> he gets the Einstein photo. He gets the Einstein photo. This is nice. So Senki testing yeah. different outfits. Yeah. The first photo, is, you know, again in, in, in the history. <laughs> Yankee Senki's best man. And cross the Senki. So cross Senki was based on Einstein. Right? So that was a nice finish there. Yeah, like the black and white photo of Senki doing the, the, the sticking out the tongue there. Yeah, that's a nice. I like it. I like it. Yeah, it's obviously like the first photo I can ever take. And he has to do the Einstein photo. I love it. <laughs> it's straightforward, man. He's like, yeah, I'm Einstein. <laughs> That was a good episode, man. I like how she's a crying. She's like, oh my god, we finally have the photo again. I can be a, I can be a reporter again. And that's kind of how we're talking about, right? You know, Senku is like, oh, with this, we can make land, we can make a reflection, right? Because a photo, in, the, in that sense, is like an imprint, right? Of a light is, right? Uh, and I mean, the, the basic, you know, science for photography, of course, is kind of simple in a sense, right? That you have something. And, 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 and even if you, go, if you go back further, it's more like, the reason we can see stuff, right, is reflection, right? We see something, uh, and every object like my body right now is reflecting light uh, towards, in this case, the camera that is represented, but you know, it's reflecting light, right? And by doing that, of course, we can then see stuff. So, how photography works, right, is that it's basically imprinting what the light was uh, showing, right? So, you need to kind of lens something, right, to be able to copy that, right? Of course, now I have a modern camera here, but obviously, the camera to me has one or more lenses. I think the camera probably has more than one lens the camera have there. Uh, I don't know the specs for it, but I, it's probably like a, it's a double lens thing <laughs> in that camera. It's an expensive camera, nobody very likely has two lenses or not even three lenses. But, um, you know, so it, that's kind of how why he has to invent glass, right? You know, he has to invent the mirror, the Kagami, or so to speak, that kind of glassy mirror thing, right? To be able to imprint stuff, right? But it was nice, I love it, yeah, he makes the classic Einstein uh, photography, so that was nice. This is probably two chapters, you know, uh, as an enemy only here. This felt very like two chapter thing, because yeah, the first bit was like, we got the chef now, we got the chef lady, we're reviving her, she's from, she's from Paris, you know, she's coming in and making bread for us. And the next part was like, you know, we're making the, the first photography, right, yeah, we're making the world's first photography, or rather than the new world's, you know, the reinvented new world's first photography right so that's pretty neat uh yeah the new character i mean kind of like it she was very stern uh, i like how she was revived immediately she was like yep i'm going over there <laughs> let's move <laughs> yeah like, oh, you just got revived i want to work <laughs> yeah and obviously i was correct i said earlier i was correct right in my uh, opening reaction in the station video links below for that right uh, when i did the video i uh, i i guessed correctly that she was gonna be like a france lady right oh she's from like paris or whatever uh, but it's kind of like she, she kind of has like Napoleon clothing her, right? The uniform, but also because uh, the Elan uniform, whatever it's called. I think it's called Elan. My France. Which is my France here, but yeah, the Elan. Because it's kind of the, the Morel or whatever. Uh, and also because she has the three color, right? She got the France, you know, the three classic three color in France. It's very, very, you know, iconic, you know, uh, in the whole of uh, France, really, right? You know, from the, from the revolution. If you go to Nice or whatever, so you, see, you see it every, you see it every, like the three color. So that's kind of her clothing design clearly. So that's why I guessed uh, last week that she was going to be from, you know, a, a, a French teen character, right? Given her color scheme was that three color. So that was pretty easy. Um, but yeah, I liked the episode. I liked it. But <laughs> I guess I was finding the first phone call, man. Basically, I was like, woman, get in the kitchen. <laughs> get into the kitchen and become a chef. Yeah, go and revive, go and revive me a woman that can cook food for me. <laughs> it's like he's just like I need to have a woman on the chef board. Um, but I guess it earlier though, from a scientific standpoint, of course it makes sense, right? Because you no, know, you, you need to be able to, uh, you have like a dog to eat, right? Yeah, but you mean you need to have food that you can last, right? And it's a very classic, you know, human evolution thing that humans la learn how to. Uh, not just store food and so on, right? For like uh, for sailing, but also for generally speaking for winter and so on, right? So that 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 is why a lot of the cooking we have today, right? You have like you smoke salmon, you cure this fish, right? As I mentioned earlier, it's because when you smoke stuff or you, you curate it with salt and so on, right? It lasts much longer, right? It doesn't rot as fast and so on. Uh, you can also of course have uh, fermented food, like you know, surströmming is very fermented, right? And then uh, that makes it still eatable, even <laughs> it's the only fermentation, right? So a lot of that stuff, of course, is um, a lot of food dishes and like different invention of food, right? Like, oh, we eat this thing, we like it smoked or whatever. But a lot of it comes from, not because it tastes tasty, 
but because this makes the food last longer. That's actually how it comes from. And a lot of spicy food, you know, I'm a, I'm a very spicy eater. Most spicy food, like an extremely spicy food, comes from, again, because it, it removes bacteria and so on, right? So the reason why you have a very, very spicy food culture in some countries is actually because the food in those countries will usually, you know, rot or get bad, or whatever, uh, quicker, right? Usually because they're so uh, high moist. And so, for example, you know, like so Southeast Asia is very spicy food, right? But that's because they're very, like, moist, right? They're very, like, watery, the, the, the environment. So the food uh, lasts shorter time, right? For example, in a cold country like Sweden, Norway, whatever, right? If you have the same meat there, in a much colder climate, it's, it's not gonna, you know, go rotten as fast as so on, right? So you don't have to invent that kind of like uh, super spicy food, right? Because there's no bacteria anyway, uh, or you just cook it and it's fine, right? So that's, you can see a lot of like how food is, uh, how to salvage the duration of food is actually the foundation of why we have different food uh, dishes, right? Uh, anyway guys, hope you liked the reaction, the review, right? Check out my IQ video, link up for that. And anyway, I guess you guys later today with the awesome uh, ranking.